get dressed, brush my teeth, and then leave. So we're gonna do that. But I thought I would take you guys along with me today and do a little day vlog. Um, I am working for five hours though. So it's probably just gonna be like after work vlog, but I thought I would just do a little get ready with me anyways. It's fun. My skin around my nose has been so dry lately. It's kind of irritating and annoying. And I, if, if you've watched like my last few videos I've talked about how like I get acne on my scalp got diagnosed it's folliculitis don't know how that happened actually have no idea um I went on antibiotics and it went away but now that I'm off the antibiotics it's coming back I just want to be healthy I, I literally just want to be healthy that's all I want um but yeah that's something I can manage guys what else has been happening in my life what else can we talk about <coughs> Oh my god, I can do like a little makeup tutorial. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do a get ready with me and a makeup tutorial. So first, I apply concealer. Like I do my skincare, I do my nice skincare routine. And then I apply concealer using like a brush because if I put the applicator on, I put way, 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 way too much on. And then I blend it out using my fingers. I don't use a beauty. I don't use beauty blender, I just use my fingers and tap it in and tap it out. I, I can't really tell if this looks any good. Okay. Now, I know most people are like, you have to powder it so it doesn't crease. My concealer doesn't crease that bad, so it's fine. I'll do that later. Next step. Look what I got. I got the Rare Beauty Blush. Oh, this is like my first ever nice makeup product, and I'm so happy about it. But you only, I put this on next because if I put powder over cream, it, if I put cream over powder, it just never, turns out looking absolutely fabulous so i put like the tiniest dot oh has anyone seen that Hailey bieber video where she like puts the tiniest bit of con uh concealer on and then yeah it's giving that vibe but you put the tiniest teeniest bit of blush on and then watch this watch this it's literally just like a dense densely packed brush but ready oh. look how pigmented it is you don't need that much. This this blush is gonna last me forever. So then I blend that out. And it's in, did I say what shade it's in? I can't remember, it's in the shade Joy. I like my blushes a little more peachy toned. So I'm very happy with this shade. It was also the last one they had left on the Sephora website when I bought it, but. Cause Sephora had like a 20% off sale and I've been wanting this blush for forever. And I was like, you know what? I'm gonna treat myself, so I did. Okay, next. We go in with bronzer. It's it's the W7 bronzer. Oh, I forgot to mention. My concealer is the... Is that upside down? Yeah. My concealer is the CoverGirl. Is it going to focus? My concealer is the CoverGirl True Blend Undercover Concealer. I forgot to mention that. And then the bronzer I'm using is the W7 The Bronzer. It was like literally $2. I'm 
broke, okay? I can't afford good makeup. So, I use drugstore makeup. And this is drugstore makeup. And it's vegan and cruelty free, so it's fine. And I just bronze my cheekbones. It's really orange, actually. It's, we're ignoring it because I can't be bothered. Honestly, it probably looks more orange than it actually is because I'm wearing, like, an orange-toned blush. But I put that on my cheek, like, cheekbones and then on my forehead. And then under my jaw and occasionally on the side of my nose. Up, up. That didn't make a whole lot of a difference, but I do it anyways. Now, now I put my, uh, my my powder on this is just the essence compact powder and I put it under my eyes and then anywhere where I put concealer nice cool lovely exceptional what's the time okay I'm not doing too bad for time then what do I do then I do eyeliner and I use I use the essence 24 ever ink liner there you go and I'm going to attempt to show you how I do it. It's going to be very difficult for me. My eyes look so lopsided. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, so first, I do a line. And if you see the line, it kind of follows from my under eye and then just, like, straight up, right? So that's the first line. And then from, like, not the very, very top, because I want that to be sharp, but just a tiny bit down, I, like, drag it back into the corner of my eye. And that's, like, the shape, if you can see that. And then I fill it in. Um, but I have been doing eyeliner for years now. I'm a dancer. It's literally, it's really just a practicing. If you practice it, you get used to it. I didn't always do my eyeliner this way. I've been doing it this way recently. But I also like to change it up. So my eyeliner may look different in every single video. And that's because I like to change it up a bit. And then to clean it up, I go in with like a Q-tip or a cotton bud, wherever you're from, however you like say it. And I just clean up the edge by just, and then we're good to go. Okay, that's my wing. And then I'm going to do the other side, so wish me luck. Okay, that's the other eye done. They're not 100% even, but it's good enough for me, and it's good enough for, for today. I'm only working, and then coming, <laughs> coming home. Uh, yeah, we'll see how it goes. And then with an eyelash curler, mine is literally just from Kmart. I curl my eyelashes. Now my eyelashes are all nice and curled and looking long and luscious and delicious. I use the Essence Lash Princess Mascara. It's the purple one. I think it's volumizing. Not sure, because there's different Lash Princess Mascaras. They're, they're like color-coded. Um, and I wipe off like 95% of the mascara. I'm not even kidding, because otherwise I feel like it's going to look clumpy. But that just might be me. I don't apply it any way special. I apply it like every other person applies mascara. Um, okay, we're done with mascara. That is all I am doing. Eyebrow gel. It's the, it, This is the the Essence Lash and Brow Gel. And then I'm running out. Actually, I need I need a new one. Okay, that's my makeup done. That was a little makeup tutorial. And I have like 25 minutes before I need to leave. <sighs> I don't know what I'm going to wear. Let's check the weather actually. It is going to be 20 degrees and raining all day. Mm, I hate this weather because it's going to be like muggy. Um. Oh, oh, hello. A bird just flew onto my window. Oh, he hello. Oh, it, it, it left. I couldn't even show you. That was weird. Anyways, I'm going to leave this and I'll show you my outfit when I picked one out. And then we will leave and go to work. Okay, so I am off to the bus stop. I am running on time. I didn't get to do a fit check in the side of the house and it is spitting a rain a little bit. But here's the fit. You can't really see it. Let me give you a close up. So I'm just wearing like a plain white t-shirt with these plaid pants. I'm walking to the bus stop, hoping that I don't miss my bus. That would not be good. Oh, and then my tote bag, it says these days. 
What does that mean? I have no idea. It also, it also has cat hair all over it, so my bad. Also, I'm wearing my favorite little dangly star moon earrings. I feel like they really put the outfit together. I made it in time, I think, I hope, I pray. <laughs> I might leave this here and I'll check back in with you eventually. We'll see when I check back in with you. But yeah, I'm going to work now. Not today. I don't need it today. I may come back for it though. <laughs> what am I doing? I am a horrible vlogger. I don't know what I'm doing. And I'm scared. It's fine. I'll just give you guys a haul when I get home. I'm just wandering around now, aimlessly, looking for stuff. What time does my bus come? Okay, it comes at 4.20. Um, Kmart haul! It's actually not that exciting, but I got two, like, nightgowns, except I'm not gonna wear this one as, like, a nightgown or a night slip dress or whatever you wanna call it. I'm probably gonna wear that as, like, an actual dress over, like, a white t-shirt in summer. Because it's cute, why not? And I got a mirror so I can stop stealing my mum's one and a little like drawer thing to put all my makeup in in the bathroom to hopefully keep it a little more organised. We'll see how that goes. And then um, my favourite lip oil because they finally had it in stock. Yeah, so that is the haul. Okay, so one thing you guys should know about me is that I am a list person. If I do not have a list, nothing gets done. So I really just want to go to sleep right now and just like nap for a solid five hours but I'm not going to do that because I want to be productive. So I'm making a list of all the things that I want to accomplish before I go to bed tonight. So, first things first is if my pen works. I need to film content for a collaboration that I have to post tonight. I want to read. I need to like schedule time to read now. I'm that busy. I want to tidy my room. Just tidy. Because it's getting a little messy and if I just tidy it now, it's not going to become a problem. So tidy my room. I don't know what else I want to do. I'll add stuff to my list if I remember stuff. So I think what I'm going to do is my camera battery is dying so I need to charge that so I'm gonna charge that and I'm gonna take my SD card and I'm gonna edit for a little bit and then I will see where we're at and then I will do one of my other things that I need to get ticked off I might tidy my room while my camera's charging as well so if you don't see that that's why um but yeah I'll check back in later I'm officially the worst vlogger. I didn't do anything I said I would do. I, um, I napped. <laughs> Who would have guessed? Um, yeah. So I napped for like an hour and then I went downstairs and I cried and then I ate dinner. <sighs> and now we're here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to tidy my room. I'm going to quickly take some photos for my Instagram story. I'm going to upload those to my Instagram story and then I'm going to film for the TikTok, post that TikTok, read and then go to bed. <laughs> Oh, 
I like tidied my room. It's not perfectly clean. I, I really need to vacuum. I haven't vacuumed in forever. But it's tidy enough for me and that's going to do. So I'm going to go film this video for TikTok. Oh, I should take photos before. No. Yeah. Mm. I'm going to film this TikTok. Um, the whole like idea of it is like a self-care night. Am I actually going to do that in 45 minutes? We'll see. Because I want to go to bed at 10 and be able to read for like 45 minutes and go to bed 10.45. That's probably not going to happen, but I can only hope. So I'm going to go film this, um, take a shower, do a face mask, do my nice skincare routine, and you'll see the result on my TikTok. If you don't follow my TikTok, you should. But yeah, so that's where I'm going to post it, but I'm going to go film that now. Let's go. <laughs> so I didn't check in on this. <laughs> um, I meant to like check in when I was doing stuff, but uh, <laughs> there was like a minor issue that happened. So I was filming the TikTok. It was going great. It was looking amazing. I was so proud of it. Um, and then I... Went to save it to drafts and accidentally posted it to my story. And then when I turned on airplane mode to try get it back to go in my drafts, usually it works every single time I've done it. It works. Like, it will just go straight back into my drafts and nothing, like, like no big deal, right? Um, no, this time it got deleted completely. They just knew I had to post it tonight and they just wanted to make my life miserable. Um, so I sorted it out, though. I was just like, I, I cried for a bit. I'm not even gonna lie. I cried. I full on cried and started panicking and started flipping out. And then I was like, okay, this has happened. It's out of my control. What else can I do? So, um, I filmed like, just like a little cozy night video instead. Um, so I did that and I posted the video. It's now quarter past 12 you know how I was like oh my gosh I want to go to bed at 10 or 11 <laughs> it's quarter past 12 and I have school in the morning oh <laughs> I want to cry but this we're just we're just having like a little chit chat session at midnight at this point oh midnight stream midnight's by Taylor Swift I got this candle the other day I went to um where was I I went to Warrandyte, which is like a little small country ish town it's not quite the country but it's close enough um and I got this pumpkin spice latte candle and I can't tell you how good it smells. I'm obsessed with it. If I, I, I want to die smelling this. It's so cool and I love it so much. And I just wanted to share it with you because it makes me so happy. It's from this little tiny shop called Whimsical Treasures. Cutest shop ever. They have so many cool little trinkets and little things. Ah, I love it. But yeah. Also, I wanna I wanna introduce you to my friend Dala. This is my Christmas squishmallow. Yes, it is still October. It hasn't even been Halloween. But I uh, went into Kmart the other day and they had these. And I remember last time I went into Kmart and I saw a squishmallow that I really, really, really wanted. They sold out, and I I never got it. So I was like, I'm not taking chances on this one. I want it, and I'm gonna get it. So I did. Halloween is like this weekend and Monday. Um, I have a party this weekend for Halloween and I'm thinking that I'm going to go as Alice in Wonderland because someone in my comments suggested it and I remembered that I do in fact have a blue dress. So I can do Alice in Wonderland but on Friday, so in two days time, my school's doing like a little Halloween fundraiser thing. So I have to dress up for that and I was trying to rack my brains on what to do and I think I'm going to go as Angelina Ballerina. I think it's so fun and so cute. Um, I don't know though. And then Monday I have to check, but I think some of my friends might be dressing up just because it is like Halloween day. Do we even have school on Monday? I don't think we have school on Monday. Wait, I might have to check that. Because, okay, so, so on Friday when we're doing this Halloween dress up thing for school, <laughs> My friends are going to sound really bitchy. I love my friends. They're amazing. Except they did a group costume and they didn't invite me. They all have classes together and I'm not in any of their classes. So they kind of organized it 
in that their class and I just wasn't there so I wasn't involved it's not like they're excluding me guys I promise I love my friends they're amazing um and there was just like no extra roles and I turned around and I'm like guys I'll come as the van I'll come as the the, the Scooby van what's it called it has a name and I cannot think of the name of the Scooby van it's not the Scooby van what's it? you know what I'm talking about though and I was like I'll come as that guys um, but I think I'm gonna go with Angeline Ballerina because I think that is fun and quirky and original and no one else is gonna think of it and I think I am a genius. My costume next year is gonna be so good though because I wanted to do it this year and I couldn't figure it out in time. So I'm gonna start preparing for it now for next year and it's gonna be awesome and I can't wait. I really should go to bed though. What's the time? It's 12.30. Okay, I'm going to go brush my teeth and then go to bed. So I'm going to say goodnight now to everyone. Thank you for just coming along and spending the day with me. And thanks for this little chat. If you have any video suggestions or things you would like to see from me, please let me know. I'm always open to any ideas and I love hearing people's suggestions. And I will see you when I see you. Okay, goodnight. Mm -hmm.